What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. In this video, I wanted to share a super cool feature which is available on Samsung Galaxy phones. And I actually got reminded of this feature with an update that we have received for this application. And I thought, why not remind you guys about this feature so that you can also start using if you have got multiple Samsung Galaxy devices. Now, before I show you the update details, let me straight away jump into the feature. Now, let's say I am browsing something on the internet on this device. This is the Galaxy S24 Ultra. And let's say I have got another Samsung device, maybe a phone or a tablet or a foldable device. You can just go to the recent application. You see on the top, this pops up here. This is the internet application which is popping up. And I can directly open this here on this device to open the same page which I was browsing on the other device. Now you see this is the page which you see here and I have got the same page available here. Now let me just go back here. Let's, uh, let me just click uh, any of the links here. Let me click this. Now uh, what I'll do is I'll go to the recents here and you see I have got the internet. I'll just open this. You see this page is showing up right here. So it will get refreshed if you are doing something on this device and if you want to open it on the other device, you will get the exact same page. This feature is called continuity service, which means there is continuity between the devices. We can seamlessly continue uh, working from one device to another on the Samsung Galaxy devices. Now this will be very useful if you have a Samsung Galaxy tablet and if you're browsing something on internet browser and you want to immediately switch to the larger screen then you can use this feature. Just go to the recent screen, you will see this pop up. Now this feature also works on Samsung Notes. Let me open the Notes application here and I will open this particular note. Now when I go to the recent application here on this device, you see Samsung Notes pop up will be appearing on the top. Just open it you will be able to open the same note which was open on this device. This is just amazing and you know this is something which is going to be very useful if you use multiple devices. As of now this feature is available only for the Samsung Notes application and the internet application. I wish Samsung adds support for more uh, Samsung applications. For example Samsung Gallery where let's say if you're editing an image on this device and if you quickly want to switch it to a larger screen device like tablet or fold uh, to edit it further we should be able to do that. Likewise it can be implemented on multiple other Samsung applications. Now let's go ahead and check out the update that we have received. Let me uh, press and hold on the Galaxy Store, tap on update application. You see we have got continuity services here. Let me tap on this. Now this is the latest version 1.2.20.8. The update came in a couple of days ago. The size is 5.26 MB and in the description it says Samsung Continuity Services connects your Galaxy devices to help you do more work. Features include you can continue apps where you left off on other devices, supported applications as of now it's only Samsung Internet and Samsung Notes. And then we've got Galaxy Buds switch automatically to other phones and tablets when a call begins or media alerts play. So this is also pretty cool. Let me show you where exactly this feature is. Let's go to settings. I will tap on connected devices here. And here you've got auto switch buds feature. You see this feature enables to automatically switch the Galaxy Buds from another device to this phone when you make a call, answer a call or play media. Which means let's say you have connected the buds on this device and uh, all of a sudden you get a call on this phone then automatically the buds will get switched to this phone so that you can uh, talk directly without manually switching it uh, to, the, uh, to this phone. So that's how this feature works. And apart from that, we also have one more feature. You can easily type text on your phone with the tablet's book cover keyboard. So if you have a tablet, a book cover keyboard, you should be able to type text on your phone, which will display on the tablet. That's another feature we have. Now this has got a brand new update. Uh, this update actually reminded me of this feature. So I thought I will share this feature with you and remind you guys we have got something like this on Galaxy phones. So let me know whether you guys are using it, uh, whether you have got multiple Samsung devices, which devices you have, whether it's a tablet, foldable, a Galaxy phone, whatever you have. Let me know in the comment section and let me know whether you use this continuity service feature or not. Drop a comment. I will go ahead and update this. And uh, uh, yeah, if you're interested in this wallpaper, I have left a link for that in the description. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead and subscribe. A lot of you guys who love to watch my contents, I've seen your comments in most of my videos. And uh, I still see more than 80% of you guys have not subscribed to the channel yet. Go ahead, subscribe. You get to learn a lot about your Galaxy phones and other devices. And if you can tap on this like button, I would really appreciate that. That motivates me to come up with a lot of uh, good stuff for you guys. So go ahead and do that. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers, bye-bye.